the sun will square Saturn and that's, that is going to deplete your energy. So that's going to make you feel like, oh, I, I just, I, I can't move another, another, another barrel full of dirt. I cannot pick up another bushel of tomatoes. I just can't do it. I just have no, well, no more energy at all. But this could also be um, where you're also playing with the, you know, the duty and the responsibilities, you know, with the, with that, with, you know, as Linda had said earlier, whenever there's a square involved and Saturn, you know, it, it's, it's that it's, 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 cha it's a challenging thing. So it's, you're going to be wondering, you know, should I, you know, mow the lawn or can I go to the park? You know, it's, 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 it's the same outside type of things, but it's going to, it's going to, it's going to add that, uh, that conflictedness that you might have in your day. Yeah, Saturn can be rather depressing and onerous. You know, you may be feeling a bit down. You've recently had that uh, Venus squaring Saturn, whereas relationships felt like, you know, more of a burden or you were noticing, you know, what you needed to sacrifice for relationships, generally speaking, or even things that brought you joy it doesn't necessarily have to be relationships it must it might be you know yeah I really enjoy binging all these shows on tv but oh I've got to pay all these bills and you know for whatever reason you know what usually brings you joy is it's kind of accenting the more not problematic but what you need to do to maintain or have those relationships or things that you enjoy uh, and yeah, and with the sun coming up, it's, you're just not feeling good, you know, feeling maybe a bit defeated, a bit depressed, a bit overworked, or, you know, you may be feeling restrictions more or limitations. 